Hello, my name is Dr. Austin Tomlinson, and I'm going to take you through the workflow of taking a traditional booklet-based exam, such as this, and getting it into grade. The first step is to scan in a blank booklet so we can tell grade what all the important parts are of the front cover. With this one, I've already removed the edges and I'm ready to scan. And here we go. Now I'm going to take that scan and upload it to Grade. So Grade knows how many pages to expect per answer booklet, and then I can also define the important regions on the front cover. The most important numbers are the student ID and the booklet number. Although Grade does take all the other ones into account, it will then cross-reference with the student ID numbers in your learning management system to make sure that it's got an accurate match. You can also define any blank pages you want to have ignored or any pages that contain personal information in case you want to mark anonymously. Now we have some stacks of answer booklets, we are ready to cut. Grade have provided me with this guillotine and this scanner and they can provide you with one too. The first thing that we need to do is raise the guillotine arm so we can lift up the safety cover. We then place our booklets into the guillotine and align them and then we lower the alignment arm like so. We then close the cover and bring the lever down and we cut. We raise the arm again, lift the safety cover and the alignment arm. We can bring out the trimmed edges and then we have a really neatly cut set of booklets. Now we've cut our booklets, it's time to scan. For this demonstration, I'm going to do one at a time, but normally we'd do more. So we place one of our booklets into the scanner and start scanning on continuous mode. Once we have a scan set, we'll place them into this box for safekeeping. So now we have a PDF containing several hundred pages of exam answers. We're going to upload them into Grade so Grade can split them up into each student's work. And now that Grade's processed it, we can correct any issues manually. And you can also see a list of all the matches it's made if you want to cross-check. So now that everything's uploaded into Grade, you can see that the front covers and the blank pages have been removed for exam marking, and I can start grading by dragging a box and clicking on the relevant feedback that I've already uploaded into Grade. This workflow gives us the benefits of traditional paper-based exams while also giving us the benefits of faster, more consistent feedback.